In this video, we are going to talk about case study questions from second chapter force and law of motion. The case study given to us is force is a push or a pull acting upon an object, the property by virtue of which an object tends to remain in the state of rest or uniform motion unless acted upon by some force is called inertia. It is a measure of mass of the body. Momentum is a product of mass and velocity of the body. Force is also defined as the product of mass and acceleration. So few information which is available here is about force. Then they have told us about inertia. Then momentum, it is a product of mass and velocity and force is the product of mass and acceleration. So you can expect questions based on this information, but it is really not necessary that all the answers you are going to find within these five, six in line given to us. But yes, it gives a fair idea where from question may be, where from they have picked up the questions. Let's take the first question. Qualitative definition of force is given by Newton's first law of motion, Newton's second law of motion, Newton's third law of motion, Newton's law of gravitation. Newton's first law of motion is also known as law of inertia. An object will remain at rest or in a motion in a straight line until unless some unbalanced force applied on it. So Newton's first law of motion gives us the qualitative definition of force, what all force is able to do. So here option A, Newton's first law of motion. Second question, a block of mass M is pulled with a force F along a smooth horizontal surface with rope of mass small m. So object mass is capital M, rope attached to it is a small m. The acceleration of the block will be where to find the acceleration of the block. We all know that F is equal to mass into acceleration. And here total mass is mass of the object and mass of the rope. So our mass is m plus m and f is equal to mass into acceleration. So acceleration is equal to f by m plus m, small m. So here correct option is option C. Now third question, a number of discs each of momentum m kg meter per second are striking a wall at the rate of n disc per minute. The force associated with this disc in Newton we have to find out. Now we all know that any object of mass m which is in motion is said to be in momentum. So momentum means object due to its motion. Now we can say P is equal to mass into velocity. P is equal to mass into velocity where P is the momentum of the whole system. What is given to us? Disc have momentum M and it is colliding at the rate n per minute. So this minute we have to convert into second. So I can write it strike at 
n by 60. Now, as per law of conservation of momentum, the momentum can be transferred from one form to another, but it cannot be destroyed or created. So, what does it mean? F is equal to dp by dt. I am coming it here. So, for me, F is equal to m into n by 60. So, here option which is correct is a m into n by 60. Our next question, the SI unit of rate of change of momentum is kg meter per second. So, correct option is option C kg meter per second. Fifth question in this case study, a force of 0 0.6 Newton acting on a body increases its velocity from 5 meter per second to 6 meter per second in 2 second. Calculate the mass of the body. F is equal to mass into acceleration. So, acceleration is V minus U by T. So, this is initial velocity is 5 meter per second and final velocity is 6 meter per second. So, and this is happening in 2 second. So, 6 minus 5 by 2 means I get 1 by 2 acceleration meter per second square. So, mass is 0 0.6. I am clearing this. So, sorry, for uh, force is given. So, mass will become force by acceleration. So, force is 0 0.6 Newton and acceleration is 1 by 2. So, zero point six into two one point two kg will be the right answer. So, option D one point two kg. Gitanjali classes is offering lots of video for CBSE students based on new pattern, case study questions, assertion and reasoning questions. We are also have videos on multiple choice questions for 10th class as well as 9th class. Please do subscribe, share and like the video. Thank you.